Hello and welcome to this episode of Suburb Craft. In this episode we're going to be taking a look at another uh, gas station. For those of you who recall, I did upload a walkthrough of a gas station about, oh, I want to say like four or five months ago, maybe six months ago. I'm not really sure. At any rate, it's been quite a while. But anyways, this gas station here is kind of a smaller, uh, really more of a corner or a mini mart than an actual proper gas station. But it's still got the pumps. Still got the, uh, well, the, the pumps are really the only gas station-y sort of things it has going for it. But, uh, yeah, it's got the pumps, it's got the sign, it's basically a gas station for all intents and purposes. So let's go on in here to the small kind of marketplace inside. Here we have the desserts and snacks, we have some cooked meats and such. And I know most gas stations don't usually sell cooked meat, but let's just pretend it's like different kinds of jerky or something. Like beef jerky, and then pork jerky, I don't, I don't know if that's what you would call it, but whatever. And then here we have kind of the uh, stationary supplies, like the books, the paper, we have some uh, tools, compasses, shears and stuff. Here we have a newspaper dispenser sort of thing. And in this back corner, here is the bathroom. Wow, it just thundered or something. Uh, anyway, here we have the little kind of beverage counter and the main uh, checkout counter area with the lottery tickets and cigarettes behind the counter. There's a cash register. And on this side of the building, well, there really isn't anything, just the garbage bins. And here we have the back side which also doesn't really have much of anything. It's kind of in the shadow of the two-door house I did the other day. I still really love that house. It's so awesome. Really like to make another one, but uh, as it stands, there aren't really any places for two-door houses in the city right now. But anyway, back to the gas station here. There really isn't a whole lot more to this. It's basically just supposed to be a small kind of rinky-dink uh, 50s or 60s era corner stop. Uh, this is the kind of place you pop in real quick to get some gas and then get right on out of... Well, I probably should put a little entryway onto this street. That'd be helpful. Maybe later. I don't know. But anyways, that's really about it for this walkthrough. Uh, as usual, if you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like or a comment or subscribe or whatnot. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, as usual, I guess I'll <laughs> hopefully see you next time. So yeah, very awkward ending here.